Hi and hello dreamers this is your Dr Bharat Kumar Vedi pharmacology faculty prep ladder in this video i'll be discussing the pharmacological aspects of ppis to understand the ppi let us take the drug pantoprazole and understand every aspect with the name itself the first letter is p p stands for these are proton pump inhibitors and remember another important aspect of p is prodrugs the next letter is a acts so these drugs acts by inhibiting h plus k plus atps pump and the inhibition of this is irreversible the next letter is n nsid induced peptic ulcer disease ppa is the drug of choice the next letter is t treatment the drugs are used in the treatment of bleeding peptic ulcer disease also they are used in the management of gerd they are also used in pre anesthetic medication and also they are used to manage the stomach ulcer as well as duodenal ulcer the next letter is o what is o for oral now when you give this drug orally they have to be taken 1 hour before the food and also when you give orally these are entry coated the next letter is p pylori sir what is pylori h pylori so these ppis are a part of h pylori eradication regimen the next letter is r sir what is r for run drug these ppis are called hit and run drug the reason is their half life is 1 to 2 hours but their duration of action is long the next letter is a a for atrophic gastritis if you are using them for very long periods the next letter is z zollinger ellison syndrome so zollinger ellison syndrome is a condition where the gastrin levels are very high leading to gastritis so these ppis are the drug of choice for that the next letter is o on prolonged usage on prolonged usage there is a risk of infections particularly pneumonia infection by clostridium difficile and also the spontaneous bacterial peritonitis in ascites patient because when you elevate the ph in the stomach there is a risk of infection going up then the next letter is l the drug lowers calcium leading to fractures it can lower b12 it can lower the iron absorption and also it can lower magnesium the last letter is e efficacy among all the drugs used in peptic ulcer disease these have maximum efficacy enzyme inhibition particularly one drug you have to remember the name is omeprazole it inhibits an enzyme called cytochrome cyp2 c19 so that's why it has an interaction with clopidogrel so with the name pantoprazole itself we understood what are the important pharmacological aspect about PBS so if you found the content useful kindly like this subscribe and share to your friends thank you all take care